Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Well, thank you so much for clicking on this video. Um, before I get into the video, please hit that subscribe button, like and comment. I'm so close to 700 subscribers and I'm praying I've actually hit it when I upload this video. So I really hope you guys enjoy this video and I'm just going to get straight into it. So today I thought I'd give Birchbox another chance. I was in Sainsbury's, um, one in Groove's Head, not too far away from me. And um, they have all of these Birchbox sets. So I actually bought... My ring light is not going to let it focus. There we go. So I actually bought the Skin Sapia kit. And this looks really cool. I believe it was £20. I bought it a couple of weeks ago when I've just got around to filming this. So I've not used a single thing in it. But I have had a little nosy. Um, I thought this looks really cool. I wasn't too impressed with the Birchbox monthly, monthly subscription. But I thought £20 for a whole set of skincare. That's not too bad. And I really did my skincare sets. But they had like a glam look, a skincare, and there was a couple of other ones. But I thought, seeing as we're pretty much still in lockdown, we can't really do too much. I ain't going to be doing no glam look anytime soon. I ain't going to run a night out anytime soon. So the glam look probably isn't going to happen for a while. So I thought, let's go with a skin one. So I'm just going to get straight into it. I will link these down below if I can. I found them in a big Sainsbury's. I'm going to presume your local Sainsbury doesn't do them. But I've never actually heard of these. I've not seen anyone online do these. This review, please correct me if I'm wrong but i literally just looked at them and seeing because i thought that'd be good for a video so here we are now so i'm just gonna hop straight into it as i said it's the skin savior skirt i had a look in it when i first got it but i do not remember what's in it but yeah it's quite cute it's got a little bay i love how it comes with a makeup bag and a little bay for birch box but i bet i can't open it i've done it oh because i ripped this off take the little thing off the bay as well while we're here this is like the perfect size makeup bag as well like if you're not doing a glam look definitely be using this bag so it's really already got a winner for the bag that's a good five pound i'd say it's quite nice leather and nice color but i'm just gonna get straight into it i lied i have used one of the products but this is the marcel marcella water normal skin oil free alcohol free fragrance free and it's for sensitive eyes i actually use this because i i allergic to the biodegradable wipes so it was great i thought i'd do something for the environment buy different facial wipes and then i remembered i had this because i came out in a rash this was really good i only actually used a tiny bit to get a full face of makeup off which is brilliant i didn't come out in any breakouts or anything after using it i probably will keep the rest of it for when i'm away you know campsites are not reopen might go camping probably won't but we can wish we can dream but yeah i've got this it's quite nice so my cellar water quite small but perfect for going away and if it's good you won't use a lot of it so hopefully well it was good but hopefully the rest of the bag is good that is the only thing i can give you my opinion on so far okay another thing in here is the polar 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 night cream it is vitalizing cream with polar algae i don't i really don't know but i have no night cream it looks like this i hope it will focus if I get my face outfit, it should. There we go. Um, this looks really good. I love the packaging. Um, I have no, like I can smell it, it's got something on top of it. I have no night cream. I don't use night cream. I really want to give it a go. I don't know what I thought it was going to smell of, but it doesn't smell of anything. But I have no night cream. I've always wanted to use night cream. Well, I have, I have a Sainsbury's one, but I kind of need it. This is why I meant by I needed to up my game. So hopefully this will be good night cream. I don't really know what night cream does. Um, night after night, skin is smoother. I'm recharged in oxygen. It looks younger. Hopefully that'll be good. The second thing I have is peeling gel. I have no idea what this is. It's by Vio. I've never heard of this brand either. I'm saying I've never heard of these brands, like they're going to be terrible brands, they're probably really expensive brands I can't afford myself. But it just says, apply a moderate amount to dry skin, massage gently in circular motion for about two minutes and rinse off. Oh, so this is going to be a bit like the Australian pink clay thing I tried. I put it on as a mask, but you were only actually meant to rub it right. That looks quite good. I've, my phone keeps going off. Now I had a video on my phone, I keep forgetting to turn my phone on, do not disturb. It's slightly irritating, but we'll move on. They had, this looks quite cool actually, do you just, I'm just presuming you put it on your face. Animal cruelty free, mineral oils, gluten free, quite 
very good. I like how Birchbox has stuff like that. Like, I didn't want to slide Birchbox off as a company because their customer service for me wasn't the best. But I suppose we are going for a time, so I thought I'd give them another chance. Now, I see this. I actually got this in the first Birchbox, what I tried out. I wasn't, haven't used it. I don't really use body creams. I'm terrible because of my fake hands, a body moisturizer. I don't really use it, but I will give it a go for the purpose of this video. So I've got two bottles of these, but I'm sure it will be good. I just don't use it. What well, I should, because I should use the body cream and then the fake tan cream, but I'm just lazy. Oh, just dropping things out the bag. Just drop the exact same thing out the bag. Come off. So now we've got the no one gets flirty with the dirty pick me up body cleanse. Okay, the chap line stink, phew. But that doesn't mean you shouldn't be anything less than fragrant. So before hitting the tongue and slapping the face of anyone who gets too familiar, use this shower gel. Okay, that's quite funny. The packaging's quite cute as well. I like the packaging. I don't know if it's focused. I think it's just focusing on me. But yeah, I quite like the packaging. I wonder what it smells like. I'm obsessed with smelling things. Mm. It doesn't really have a scent, but I'm sure it's probably really good shower gel or body cleanser, whatever you want to call it. Squeeze a small amount of the gel into the palm of your hand and gently put it around. The bottle is also recyclable, it's brilliant, and I can't wait to give this a go. Um, I actually do need to get shower tonight, I was going to lie inside I didn't, but I do need to get shower. The weather, too hot for me, for my Irish skin, can't cope, so I will definitely be getting a shower tonight. Oh, talking of the Australian pink clay, this is exactly what I was on about, the purifying face mask. Doesn't tell you how to use it, but I'm presuming it's just a normal face mask. So I like a little one of these. I, um, I actually got these in the actual birch box as well. I really liked it. It's meant to be really good. I actually should have a look and get in the full side product because it was really good for my skin. But I'm just lazy and don't like spending money. Well, I do, but... I just haven't cried just any money on skincare and stuff because I think once it's gone, it's gone. Whereas at least with clothes that you wear it multiple times. But I suppose you use the skincare multiple times. But this looks brilliant. Another facial scrubber, travel friendly for your face. Just looks like this, quite handy. As you can see, I'm like hiding behind it so it focuses. Yeah, it's by After Spa. I'm sure this will be really nice. And it's actually quite good because like, I wouldn't want to take my full cleanser on holiday with me. It's like a little sponge. And it feels... I will be using this tonight. It's got like a little hanging up thing. What's quite cute. I thought it was going to be for a wrist, but obviously that's far too small, Natasha. But yeah, it feels nice. It doesn't feel too hard on your skin but again i will be using this tonight so i will give you an honest review and the last thing i have is the second australian natural signature facial cleanser this looks like really expensive facial cleanser for some reason i'm not really sure why but i feel like bottles with a pump just do i'm sure this will be brilliant i love facial i'm always trying to come with a pump on oh, it so, smells like nice moisturizer i cannot wait to use this and it's for all skin types so it's perfect again i'll probably use this tonight before i oh no i've got the night cream i'll use this in the morning and let you know my honest review of this or maybe once i take this makeup off because i will be taking that off in a minute and let you know what this feels like and the last thing in there is the beauty pro thermal foil thermal foil mask hydrating and brightening one shape mask Warm silver foil mask with vitamin C and green tea for all skin types. This looks really cool. I hope it focuses for you. But I love a good face mask. I'm always up for trying a new one. So I will let you know. I just wanted to unbox this for you at the beginning of the video. Show you if you were interested. You can watch on and see what the items are like. If not, click off the video. And I hope you enjoyed seeing my face. But the next key clip will be me using the product. Um, actually, what's quite cool in this skin saviour is that you get a five point off. 
yeah get your first birch oh get your first birch box for just five pound well it's quite good i'm quite impressed with this i'm very happy with the makeup bag who doesn't need a new makeup bag i've only got about 10 in my room what i need to get rid of already but i'm quite impressed with that it's a lot better than the actual birch box in my opinion i will link my birch box review down below and obviously the next few kits will be me trying out the products so i've just filmed the intro to this video and i'm just gonna go ahead and take this makeup off because i've been filming and i don't need to do any more so i just use this soft pure um like tiny whites i should have got the bigger ones really but these are the only ones i had in savers and i didn't want to go into loads of shops because it was just unnecessary when they had these tiny ones and with everything going on at the minute we were already in there so it was a lot easier then so i'm gonna go ahead and use the micellar micellar water um as i said i've used this before but i will just show you how many it uses again because i used it when i first got it by accident because i realized i had no makeup wipes so i've just put a tiny bit on there and it's actually taking quite a lot like i didn't even feel the cotton pad and it's definitely if i just zoom in a little that'll be easier move back a little because i can't be bothered to move my tripod up but that looks all really good like you can actually see my phone keeps going off today i'm so sorry you can actually see how red my skin is underneath all of this I did not do the best makeup either today because I've been filming two videos so it's like all sweating off because it's so hot today. So that is like one wipe, it's completely how dirty that is. That's quite good, that's one. I'm hoping I won't use any more than three. That's just because I like to make sure I've definitely got all my makeup off, especially because I don't have a face wash and I want to give an honest view. Like normally I just get half my makeup off and then do the rest with a face wash but obviously i can't do that today but well, it my eyes a little bit and i think it might actually have all of my makeup off as well yeah it does what is really good i'm actually really impressed my skin feels really smooth as well and I literally used like two ones where I completely covered and one where I could use more if there was more makeup on my skin. But obviously there isn't. And yeah, I am so impressed. I will zoom you into my eyes. But like the whole makeup is off. My skin feels so soft as well. I am really, really impressed with that. But I'm also going to use the moisturiser now. So I'm also going to be using the second facial moisturiser, what you would have just seen. I'm going to do, oh, I've done one pump, that was far too much. You do not even need one pump in this. I don't know what I'm going to do with the rest of that. Just wait on my leg for a while. I have done far too much. This is maybe why I don't get a pump one. But yeah, you do not need anywhere near as much as I put. Oh, maybe half a pump would do. I'm just looking this way because I've actually got a mirror there. It's a lot easier to see than the viewfinder. But that is perfect. <laughs> that moisturiser feels so soothing on the skin. My face feels so soft. And I don't feel like oily. Like it feels nice. I don't know how to explain it. But I really like that. Obviously, I will let you know what it's like during the day. See what my skin's like. And I'll use the products for the day. Like, I probably won't use the rest of them until later tonight. But I just thought I'd do that now. Because, obviously, I wanted to take my makeup off. So, I'm just about to get in the bath. So, I'm going to actually use the Firma Furby Warm Silver Foil Mask with the vitamin C. This one here, if it will focus for you. And I have literally never tried this. It's by Pu Beauty Pro and it's just got vitamin C, green tea, boost complexion, all that jazz. I really have no idea. It's a lot later or not. It's at 9pm. I'll give this a go. I don't really wear sheet masks. I'm more of a, um, like a one you put a brush on with. And this looks really odd. Look how it actually is foil. I mean, I'm not sure what I expected, but oh, I should have done this in the bathroom. I've messed it up already. 
Oh, but I wouldn't look like such an idiot. I'm gonna presume it goes on this way. There's the foils on the other side. <laughs> oh my god, this is not a thing. <laughs> this surely not. It doesn't. Not, these never fit my face properly either. I mean, at least it fits my face quite well, but surely this is not an actual thing. And what is this from Beauty Bra? I'm actually going to have to Google how much these are. I can't even zoom you in because it's all over my hands. But this is like, <laughs> it's actually for you. I will take it off in, how long does it say? 20 minutes. A 20 minute treatment. That's quite long for a face mask actually. But yeah, I will leave this on. It does fit my face quite well. It's good. Most face masks don't. But I just don't believe that, that this is an actual thing what people buy. It looks so stupid. I keep looking here because the mirror is here. But um, I will get back to you in 20 minutes and let you know how my skin feels. So this is actually quite weird because it's actually dried. Like you can't feel it anymore. Like it was all sloppy. But it's the weirdest face mask ever. Like I'm not really sure about it. My skin is like all stayed on the skin. Like some people like rub it in. I really don't know. I don't use face masks. My skin feels really soft there. That's all I ever say when I put a face mask on. Um, I don't know if it looks bright or not. I don't know. Like, I'll zoom in and you can see it, but I don't know if it looks any softer. That is my skin. My eyebrows look atrocious. I suppose it does look quite nice. Yeah. Quite happy with that. It wasn't bad. I want to know how much it is. I'm going to Google that and let you know before the end of this video. Cause I'm really curious see how much that is because I literally have no idea but yeah my skin looks quite revitalized as it said on the packaging but, um yeah I'm actually gonna get in a bath now and I'm gonna use some of my other products I'm not gonna use the Australian pink clay because it's a purifying mask but I've used this before and it's literally brilliant um I get loads of these tiny ones and all of these type of bags so obviously I'm not gonna use it again but I am going to like wash my face in the bath and use this so I'll let you know how that is. I will probably use some simple face wash with this because that's the face wash I use. And then I'll well, use that tonight. Um, I'll probably use this when I'm out of the bath as well. Just give my the peeling gel and I'll use the body moisturiser and I will use the shower gel in the bath. Literally just sat on my bathroom floor and I'm actually going to use this facial cleanser on camera so i've just put some facial wash on it and dampened it with hot water i just started to feel it's light now i did all of my makeup off last earlier on in this video but i just started to see if it didn't pick anything else up oh it actually has wow i think i put a bit too much on it but obviously i didn't want to do it when i had the camera in my hand because i just got it and this is literally my baby so i didn't want to then oh my god this feels so good on my skin wow i am so impressed and i actually got more makeup off which is really good as you guys can see but that dirt was actually on my face so yeah i'm really impressed with this obviously i'm gonna go and dampen this and get the soap off my face well the cleanser off it but yeah i am so impressed with that because i actually got more makeup off and my skin just feels so got on my hair my skin just feels so soft so yeah i'm just gonna go and wash that off now and you guys will see me when i'm at the bath so i just want to apologize for the lighting of this clip but i can't be bothered to get my ring light out like i'm about to get back in the bed but i'm gonna open to turn it on so i've just used the moisturizer the rituals one as you can see if it focuses but i don't know why that's not focusing but I've just used the Rituals Face um, body, body Cream and it's so soft, it dried so quickly. I freshly shaved my legs and everything and it's so nice. But no, I, I'm going to use the peeling gel in the morning just because it's quite late and I kind of want to get into bed. But no, I, I'm just going to put the face cream on, it's the Polar Revitalising Face Cream. So I'm just going to put some of that on. I really don't know how much you need. as i said i don't really use night cream i really should i know but i just don't really use it 
And oh my god, my grin feels so soft. Now it is quite thick, but I leave night creams are quite thick, so obviously you're not gonna you're not putting makeup on top of them or anything. But yeah, I actually really I like the feel of it and I like the glow it's like giving me. It feels really soft on my skin and I'm really impressed. I'm just gonna move you to the light so you can see a bit better. Please ignore my Diet Pepsi issue. But yeah, I've just put that on and that's all I'm going to do for tonight. So I will get back to you in the morning to let you know how my skin feels, if I'm feeling good. And to use the peeling gel for you guys. And then that is my review of the box over and done with. I also just want to quickly say the night cream was so nice. It was quite a thick consistency, but I didn't feel it by the time I was actually going to sleep. And my skin felt amazing this morning. Like I've not come out in any spots or anything. And I absolutely loved it. Hey guys, so it's the next one and my skin feels absolutely amazing. Um, I loved the cleansing brush last night. Everything, the face mask was a bit odd. But I haven't come out in any breakouts, I don't believe. And I get a breakout really quickly after I've used something. So I would know about it by now. But I just wanted to show you a face wash I've been using. And it's the simple moisturising face wash. It's 100% soap free. I hope it focuses yeah um it's just kind of skin it's the first sensitive skin one and i don't actually really have sensitive face skin but i just prefer using it i feel like it's a lot better and my legs and my arms and everything feels so soft from that body cream i'm actually really impressed with this bag it is a lot better than the monthly beauty book um yeah beauty box from birch box but i've got one more thing to try and it is actually this vo rose gourmage peeling gel so it says apply a moderate amount onto dry and clean skin massage gently in circular motion for about two minutes and then run, rinse off hey fever is so bad today so um, that is what i'm gonna do i've just washed my face off obviously the simple facial wash and i'm just gonna why does everything have one of these on it like that silver thing you have to peel off apply a moderate amount but i don't Oh, it's like a facial scrub. Okay. It's not really a peel appealing gel to me, would have been like. You know, like. I don't know. I always try and get in, like, my nose area because that is where I get the most spots. I don't feel like I'm putting off at once. This isn't plant moderate of mine. This is the weirdest thing I've ever used. It's like facial scrub, scrub, but I'm looking this way because I've got a mirror here. But it's like dry. I don't know. It's really awkward. But it's quite nice on your skin though. I'm just really getting it into that nose area because that is where my skin has a lot of pores and I get a lot of spots in them creases. And it's like went like that on my hand. It's so odd. Oh, it is like peeling off. That is so weird. Should have done this in the bathroom. Oh my god, my skin feels absolutely amazing. I'm gonna pick you up and zoom you in. My skin, ignore the complexion, but it feels so, so good. It feels so shiny. That was literally amazing. I am so impressed with that product. I've literally never heard of it in my life either it's just like there's a vo vo rose gummish peel gel a gentle botanic exfoliator and it's literally so good i'm so impressed my skin is just glowing so that is the end of this video i am so impressed with this birch box well this like birch bag i purchased it from sainsbury's for about 20 pound but i will link it down below if i can but i'm so impressed with all the products i've got they worked wonders on my skin and i will definitely be reusing every product because i am so happy with them so i really hope you enjoyed this video please like and comment and subscribe down below i've just hit 700 subscribers this morning and i am so grateful so thank you so much and i will see you guys next time bye